This video is totally different from the previous IU video which we uploaded. IU, who attended kindergarten since the age of three, thanks to her mother who had a passion for learning, studied well since childhood. As she was in kindergarten, she won the grand prize from the oratorical competition. Already in elementary school, Ayu studied so well that she won first and second place in class, and even became the president of the school. Also, growing up with her parents who were unusually close to her, she had no financial difficulties until elementary school. But when she was in the sixth grade of elementary school, her mother made a mistake with her debt guarantee, and the whole family was thrown out on the street. Ayu saw her house go into foreclosure, and people she didn't know come to the house to collect debts. Not long after, she was separated from her parents and ended up living with her younger brother and grandmother. Then one day, during her freshman year of middle school, she happened to dream of being a singer. It all happened when the teacher asked Ayu to sing in front of her friends as punishment for constantly talking to her friends in class. But contrary to what the teacher expected, Ayu was happy to sing in front of the others, so the teacher angrily said, you will go on the opening stage of the school festival and sing in front of all the students. However, on the day of the long-awaited festival, she was so excited and happy that hundreds of people saw her on the stage, so she decided to become a singer. But contrary to her determination, her family's financial situation continued to deteriorate. Her grandmother had to sell accessories on the street to make a living, but it was hard, so they had to eat potatoes and other things her grandmother struggled to bring and eventually, they even had to move to a small single room. But there was another problem, because apart from the cold in the single room, which was really hard to bear, there were too many cockroaches. There were so many cockroaches that they couldn't even sleep, so they stayed at their relative's house for a while. Meanwhile, Ayu, who has decided to be a singer, had auditioned for 20 agencies including JYP, but all this failed. She always came back from singing practice late at night and went to her room to sleep. But her male relative came home after drinking and he got angry with his wife and said, They haven't left yet? A child should study. How can she dream to be a singer? Her dreams are in vain. Does she think anybody can be a celebrity? I would be a millionaire before she became a celebrity. Her relatives thought she would not hear this and was already asleep. But Ayu heard everything. Hearing this saddened Ayu. She clenched her little fist and promised herself, I will succeed no matter what. She suffered under these conditions for about a year and a half, and after her debut, she later said so on a show. For Ayu, the poverty and these gloomy memories remained as a big scar. But in this situation, Ayu didn't decide to be depressed, but to fight and choose music. And those practicing moments were the only time she could forget all about her harsh reality and have other thoughts. So she kept listening to more songs and singing all the time. But those tough experiences at such a young age made Ayu grow up far too quickly. Meanwhile, after repeated auditions, Ayu was accepted into Loen Entertainment in hopes that things would finally get better, but they didn't. After Ayu was finally a trainee, another company promised to put her on a show, but they asked for a large sum of money, which ended up being a scam. It may be painful to lose your own money, but Ayu was cheated out of her grandmother's money, which she had made selling accessories on the street under difficult circumstances, and that was even sadder. But even after Ayu's grandmother heard that she had been scammed out of this money, her worries and tears were only for her granddaughter, so she didn't even get angry. Instead, she gave Ayu $50 saying, buy something delicious, which made the situation even more sad. However, these bad experiences didn't stop her from honing her skills. Ayu debuted at the age of 15, nine months after becoming a trainee, thanks to the full support of her agency's singers and representatives. The agency introduced Ayu's singing skills to the public, saying that despite the young age of 15, she has a mature voice and her sensitivity is very good. 안녕하세요. 저는 신인 가수 아이유고요. 아이유, 아이유고요. 타이틀곡인 미아라는 곡입니다. 감사합니다. But after her long-awaited debut, she had a terrifying experience that she will never forget 
right on stage singing the title track Lost Child, because the day of her debut was also the day that many male idols emerged, and so there were many female fans wanting to cheer on the male idols. But as soon as IU started singing, insulting words came like, hey, have you practiced at all? And you look like a pig. Ayu had expected that regardless of whether she was popular or not, people would at least listen to her song, but this experience had crushed all her hopes. The audience's eyes were on her, but at the same time, they insulted Ayu for waiting for their idols, an experience just too bitter for Ayu, who was only in third grade middle school. Furthermore, her debut album didn't sell well, only selling less than 3,000 copies, probably because the dark atmosphere didn't suit her age, actually and the people didn't have interest in her. So even the articles came out stating Mia sang Ayu instead of Ayu sang Mia. However, the agency quickly realized their mistake and immediately changed the concept to cuteness, and Ayu returned with a new album. And since then, Ayu has been loved by many for her song Boo, along with her unique, lovely, and cute appearance that suits her bright teenage appearance. Meanwhile, Ayu was very worried and thought, what if the company doesn't put me on stage again? And determined to survive somehow, she sang on all stages, to the extent of performing at a horse racetrack. But, at the same time, while appearing on various cable TV programs and making her face known, she gained a great deal of recognition through one broadcast. When she appeared on the program named Yuhi Yo Sketchbook, Yuhi Yo's facial expression was so surprised by the talented singing Ayu that a meme called Runaway Ayu came out and this reached the top of the real time search keyword. And with her next song Marshmallow, she slowly gained public recognition. After Marshmallow, she was very busy with more than 10 regular guest shows on the radio but she also received a lot of love for her duet. After that, her first regular appearances on the SBS entertainment show Heroes of Heroes began to emerge, and her face became more and more well-known. Also at that time, IU released one song called Good Day. Better known for its three-tone high-pitched voice, Good Day garnered widespread attention, earning her the first-time number one spot on the music charts, which in turn propelled IU to national stardom. However, with great popularity came a period of random rumors and accusations against her. For example, the agency's total revenue was $5 million, but an article said IU made $5 million this year alone, so she had a hard time because of this huge misunderstanding. She later said this in an interview about the burden of public interest. I am now afraid that everything I want to say will be interpreted differently, and everything I say and do will be published in an article. Meanwhile, Ayu made her first appearance in the drama Dream High, but after the song Good Day, her schedule was way too busy, so she had to take up to 20 appointments a day and hardly got any sleep. Later in an interview from this time, she answered the question, what time did you wake up today, with, which time, I didn't wake up today, and many felt sorry for her. So she was extremely active in music, acting, and even in the entertainment industry. But one day, the agency suddenly announced that IU would stop all musical activities. Due to the extremely busy schedule, IU couldn't get enough sleep, so she even said, I really want to get some sleep. In fact, according to the agency at this time, Ayu had taken part in drama and entertainment programs during the week and even appeared in music programs on the weekends, and like that, she had an average of two hours sleep per day. The agency said, Ayu's stamina is really at the end, 
and hoped the public would understand. But some people always criticized this, saying, Has Ayu gotten into acting or into variety shows that make more money, not music anymore? I am sorry that Ayu has lost her original intent. And Ayu released a new album after about a year of her music activities being suspended. And all 13 songs in her second album at the time were at the top of the music charts. Ayu, who worried too much while preparing for this album, lost so much weight that she started losing her hair, and people around her started to tell her that she looked like a skeleton. On the other hand, after her diligently produced second album, and after You and I, she won 18 advertising contracts and even earned the nickname CF Queen. However, as the saying goes, if you get something, you lose something. Ayu was gaining popularity at that time, but she paid a high price for it with the lack of sleep. She didn't have the time for sleeping, but even though she had time for napping, she couldn't sleep deeply because she had to wake up and go on stage to sing as soon as her turn came. And because of this unhealthy sleep pattern, Ayu got severe insomnia, which has been hard on her even recently. Meanwhile, she caused a huge controversy by accidentally posting personal photos online but she was able to calm things down by admitting it was her fault and wrongdoing. Since then, she has greatly reduced her appearance in entertainment shows and has been acting in drama steadily. And only a year later, she topped the music charts again with her third album. And with her self-composed song Friday, she later ranked first once again. Since then, she has been loved more than ever through various collaborations and remakes of other songs. And among them, the most loved song was Sanyo Lim's original song Meaning of You. Because this song has been loved by middle-aged people in the past, IU expanded her fandom's age range by remaking this song. But as much as 21-year-old IU's life seemed glamorous from the outside, she was on the brink of a collapse. Whenever she was asked, What do you think of your outstanding achievements? She would say, I'm a singer in a fragile bubble from the beginning of her debut on, and maybe she had the feeling that the bubble was about to burst at any moment. She hasn't had stage fright since her debut, but at some point, she suddenly became afraid of performing in front of people, and it got so bad that she even had to take a sedative to go on stage. All of a sudden, people's attention became a burden. Her face turned red, she started sweating, and eventually became unable to sing on stage at all. The day she didn't believe in herself piled up, and finally, Ayu hated herself. Eventually, the situation became so severe that she was lethargic all day and she could only eat and sleep. She wasn't hungry, but Ayu ate anyway because she felt empty inside and thought she could fill that emptiness in this way. Ayu's days consisted only of eating and sleeping over and over again. She even ate to the point of vomiting and was eventually treated for bulimia. And to overcome that terrible slump, Ayu chose production where she does everything by herself, including planning, writing, and composing the song. She made that decision thinking, even if all the bubbles burst around me, at least I'll live comfortably. Even if it's shabby, it's better than living in fear but glamorously. And the album that came out in that harsh process called Chatshire was very famous.
As soon as the album was released, it blew up all the album charts. It was the first album she was responsible for producing, and perhaps she had tried to do too much at once. After a brief moment of happiness, everything changed and flowed in a direction she never expected. The photos from the Chat Chair album and her appearance in the music video began to raise suspicions that IU was using the Lolita concept. Also, My Sweet Orange Tree's Korean publishing company Tongmyok released a statement saying, IU, Cheche is not that kind of kid, and the problem started to get bigger. The company criticized the lyrics of Cheche and the illustration of Cheche in here, claiming that IU would give the innocent character of My Sweet Orange Tree a dirty aspect. Countless broadcasters and critics began accusing each other of IU was right or wrong, and just two months earlier, IU, who garnered a lot of love for her song Leon, but after this issue, she was at the center of a national controversy. And even a petition came up on the internet such as, I ask for the abolition of IU's album, while more than 30,000 people agreed to it. In response, IU said, I never wrote the lyrics with that inappropriate intention. I am deeply sorry for causing disappointment and pain to many people. It was my first time producing a whole album, and it seems that I was not good enough. And again, after a year and a half, she came back with a new album. It was the fourth album, Palette, where she processed the time she had recorded in her early 20s in her diary. It was a more carefully prepared album because of the controversy before, and just as she wished, the results were very good, but something terrible happened shortly after. That year in December, Shiny's Kim Jong-kyun became a star in the sky. It was especially hard for her because IU herself said, There are only a few people I can say I'm really close to, and Jong-kyun is one of them. So she lost a colleague and close friend who had similar worries and problems. And just two days later, when she had to sing Meaning of You on stage, she shed countless tears without being able to finish the song, and many people felt alike. As some time passed, she came to the drama My Mister. Due to the earlier controversy with Ayu over the Cheche issue, this drama has been labeled an affair dealing with an inappropriate meeting between a middle-aged man and a young woman with an 18-year age difference and at the beginning of the drama, it came to a great controversy. However, as the episodes progressed, My Mister showed that it wasn't such a work at all, and it became the drama of their life for many people. <laughs> After My Mister, she received overwhelming acclaim, with rave reviews saying, I can't imagine Lee ji being played by someone other than IU. Since then, she has participated in various works such as Persona and Hotel de Luna, while presenting her fifth mini-album Love Poem. And when everything looked like it was finally going really well, IU had to face another tragedy. Shortly before the release of the new album, her best friend Sully became another star in the sky. With the news about Sully, who was famous in the entertainment industry as IU's best friend, the song Peach, written by Ayu for Soli, was seen in a new light. Ayu, who is actually a mentally strong person, was so devastated that she even postponed the album release and took a personal break to process the loss of Soli. Later, IU finally released the album and started a nationwide concert tour. But here too, IU was once again confronted with another tragedy. At the end of the performance in the Seoul Concert Hall, she heard that Kuhara was now another star in the sky. Only a month after saying goodbye to Soli, IU had to bear the loss of another best friend Kuhara. So she was really having a hard time, and even the audience in the concert hall could feel her gloomy mood. 
Ayu couldn't hide her shock, saying, That's why we must love each other very much. I hope people will love each other, even though the world is sometimes gross. Then, after saying these words on stage, Yi Ji Eun sang Dear Name with a tearful voice. The voice I long for even in my dreams, I call out the name, but there's no answer. And through the endlessly lost, cold, and cruel days, I know your name that has silently been forgotten. I won't stop. I'll shout out several times. And many people cried on her behalf. So Ayu's 20s were already coming to an end, and Ayu, who debuted at the age of 15, had already turned 28 and was preparing to say goodbye to this tough time as she released her fifth album, Lilac. Then, Ayu launched into her 30s by presenting her new song Strawberry Moon and the album Pieces, which consists of a collection of self-composed songs. <laughs> However, when Ayu turned 30, she appeared in the film Broker and was later invited to the Cannes Film Festival, where she was able to showcase not only her music skills, but also the fact that her acting skills had peaked. A lot of people love Ayu for her look, her personality, and her musical ability, but my thoughts on her are a bit different. As you learned in this video, Ayu has suffered deep wounds and had to overcome many ups and downs. But instead of collapsing, she didn't let this bring her down, but grew on her pain and got stronger. Of course, she made mistakes too. All the losses, humiliation, struggles, setbacks, etc. that she had to endure and overcome show that none of us is perfect, but we can always improve with hard work. And that's why I admire the person Yi Ji Eun behind singer Ayu even more. Ayu, who has 28 million Instagram followers, may not be able to check all the comments and messages, but nevertheless, sometimes she checks them. That's the time when she wants to see someone say you are pretty. So if you ever have the time, go to her Instagram or YouTube channel and write you are pretty for her. Who knows, maybe your comment will make Ayu happy today. <laughs>